And we will start off by talking about uh, specific, measurable, and relevant, because those three conceptually, uh, those three go together very well. So we'll talk about specific first. Specific goals are goals that are clear and unambiguous, and they avoid being vague or general. The way I think about specific or specificity in regard to goals is like I used to watch Columbo a lot when I was a kid and uh, Columbo was about this like old timey detective and he would always ask people you know who what where why he would whenever he was talking to someone about their version of of you know this crime that had happened that he wanted to solve uh, he would really drill down into their responses um, to, to get the important information and we want to treat our goals the same way. When you come up with a goal, you want to interrogate it. You want to make sure that you have all of this technical information embedded within that goal. This is a uh, real smart goal that I received from one of my student groups in, in one of my classes. Uh, they said that we will create a database of organizations. So we can think of our old timey detective here and he pops up and he says, who, who is going to be in that database? And we reply, it's gonna be a database of profit, not for profit and government organizations. And so as you can see, we're already moving, uh, just by answering that simple question, we already have a lot more specificity. Next, we can ask where, and we can say, okay, we're gonna look for these organizations that operate in Marin. What, what information is going to be included in the database? So we are going to include email, physical address, and phone number. That answers the what is going to be included in the database. And then, and this is really important, we need to answer why. Why are we doing this? What is the greater purpose that we are trying to achieve? When you give someone a goal, they are invariably going to have to uh, make compromises, make decisions, use their judgment in carrying out that goal. And it makes it a lot easier for them to do that if they understand overall what are they are trying to achieve. What is the purpose of all of this? So by explaining why you're trying to accomplish a goal, uh, you're helping people make the right decisions to get the goal accomplished in the way you want it accomplished. So here we say that uh, we're creating this database to target um, these organizations for marketing survey responses. So now you can see our goal that we have made more specific. We say that we will create a database of profit, not-for-profit, and government organizations in Marin that includes email, physical address, and phone number to targeting for marketing survey response. And we can compare this to our original goal, which was we will create a database of organizations. And you can just clearly see uh, the difference in specificity. A good way to know if you have a SMART goal is uh, if you're delegating work and you died tomorrow, a comet hits you tomorrow, and you had given this assignment to someone to complete, are they going to have enough direction to complete it with no other feedback from you, just from the SMART goal alone? Or another way to think about it is if I gave this assignment to 20 different people, uh, would I get a similar response, a similar final product from each of them? Uh, if I ask 20 students, you know, for their homework assignment to create a database of organizations, and that's all the direction I give them, I'm going to get 20 very different databases. But if I ask my students to create a database of profit, not-for-profit, and government organizations in Marin that includes their email, physical address, and phone number so that I can target them for survey responses, there's still going to be some individual differences in those databases I get. Uh, but they're going to be a lot more similar than if I had just said, hey, go make me a database of organizations. And through the rest of the lecture, we're going to talk about how we can make it even, uh, how, how I can make my expectations even more clear. So we go from this very vague goal to create a database to this specific goal that answers who, where, what, and why.